Hello everyone, welcome back to Diablo 3. Let's continue Act 2. I took a little break, got something to eat. So let's continue. Oh. And let's see what I can do. Um I don't know where I was. Oh, I cleared these two houses. Um, so I can cross the oh, bridge. No. Oh, and I lost out, so I have to do this if I don't this time. That's okay. That is absolutely okay. Um, Prepare for a long fight! What the hell is all of this? Need more time. Oh, I'm pressing ground button. Legendary. Oh no, I found something else. Um, let me take a look. Wait, did I not? Oh, I didn't empty my shit. Okay, I will have to redo that. Um, I'm not going to rediscover this area. I'm just going to go cross it to the objective Those as soon as I find it. Let me take a look. A one. What did I find? Here we go. We Blacksmith. The the Blacksmith for the far. Legendary shields. Okay. Well, since I'm not going to, to use shields, I'm not going to use that item in this playthrough. I actually don't think I will do another playthrough of this game. After this is done, but anyway, I I will probably do another one when they are like, oh, the Abelio Four is coming out, and I will be okay. I heard you came here from Tristram. My family came from there. I will do that. This has had some very bad luck, hasn't it? Go. So all of this garbage. Um and let's go. Being in this form, holy god. Okay. Here we go. I think it is time for you to know my true tale. Okay. Tell me. Tell me. I am not from Chaldeum. I learned these spells 1500 years ago. My sisters and I pledged our service to a man of great power. We called him the Prophet. He trained us and placed us in a magical slumber to awaken in this era. I am to prevent the Lords of Hell from invading. You're serious, aren't you? I read about a stasis spell like that once, but I never tried it. Come with me. It will be nice to have another mage along. The Templar with the Enche. Sure, I will do that. Stand together against the shadows. Why not? Um, let's see. What do you have? Temporal chance, an enemy to fight for you. That's pretty cool. Creates an explosion that deals massive damage and knockbacks enemies. I will A go for that. Ability. Missile ward reduces damage from attacks. Okay. I would have done this. the same. Um, 
pool of energy it deals damage. But do you want to know that will be of use. this? Here we go. My favorite. Here we go. Now Let's to find the casino you. post. You will find it to the north, though it is still some distance away. Oh, what the hell is this? That's pretty cool. Here we go. Ooh. Okay. I seem to be pressing a lot of wrong buttons. This is effective though, fallen. holy god. It's like a kill everything button. This might actually be the way to go. No, it's not. Okay. Well, let's once again take a look around the area. See if I cannot find anything. Lucky Girl Skull. Nope. Garbage. Oh, I'm using a staff. Not a want anymore. That's good. This is no illusion. The road is blocked. I must go through Kasim Outpost to the west. Then A and all the instead of one, two, three. Air. It's really we annoying. Must be getting closer. Let's go into this dungeon. Let's see what's in here. Quite explosive. Okay, so there doesn't seem to be anything in here. Hmm. Disappointing. Um, I still have to unlock a little bit of the middle area. Let's continue. Let's continue. Um. <laughs> Let's 
probably another big place to discover. The ground! It, it's shaking! Oh. Can't feel my legs! Oh. My legs! You don't have legs and you're gone. Oh! Amazing, I like this spell. It's amazing, it's like become way too strong. Still waiting. What brings a necromancer to this forsaken desert? Powerful spirits haunt these ruins. I was not strong enough to defeat them, but I was able to trap them. I fear the coven that invades the region will try to use the spirits for their nefarious purposes. But if you dare, you can try to put them to rest. Activate the totems to release the spirits, and be prepared to fight. Okay. Oh, I should have waited for my thing to regain. And you hear their angry voices. Still more remain. One more left. The dead are insidious, my friend. Do not forget that. Spirits. The voices fade. The spirits in this place are calm. I can begin the work of freeing them. Good man. Oh, I have to talk to you. The howling of the spirits lessens. You have put them to rest. Listen. The common. the common, but I fear they will find other, darker powers to exploit. Thank you, and go with the blessings of Rathma. Thank you, good sir. Thank you. That, that's another way why you have to explore Not just ready yet. a little bit. Get the side you know, they're part of the game and they're pretty fun to do. Even if they are just a little bit too short. I don't know, maybe... I don't know, they're just, just too short. Maybe another wave or so would be cool. I don't know. Didn't see that coming, did you? Pum, 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 pum. Uh, that exploded weirdly. Um, Belial, Lord of Lies, is the most elusive of the seven evils and is a master of deceit. It is said that he manipulated Asmodan into revolt against the prime evils. This began the Burning Hell's civil war which ended with the dark exile of the prime evils to our mortal realm. Okay. Um, let me take 
take a look at the map. I have done this entire area. So let's head north. Even if I have to go south. We shall go north to go south. Sounds like a good idea. Hello. It is too quiet. Indeed. We've been safe ever since the Imperial Guard came. Mm-hmm. I need you to open the gate. I must reach Alcarnas. You must be mad. But if you're intent on rushing headlong to your death, talk to Captain David down in the command post. He's got the gate key. Okay, let's enter the command post. Oh, here you are, delivered unto me as a sacrifice, a gift from Lord Belial. Sacrifice? Um. Me? Belial set you here as bait to lure me away from his treachery in Chaldeum. No, he would never betray me. Strike him down. Belial is the Lord of Lies, Magda. The truth is, you were dead the minute you killed Cain. Not a moment too soon. They plan to sacrifice us to Belial. Iron Wolves, take back the town! Okay, that was pretty easy. These serpentine demons are Belial's favored servants, and he has granted them some of his skill in cunning and illusion. Deceivers will cloak themselves in the familiar forms of their enemies' companions and friends, waiting to strike when the moment is opportune. It is only then that their true forms are revealed. Okay, let's go take back the town. Let's talk to Captain David. Has Magda reached Alcarnas? Yes, we've heard rumors of a horrible slaughter there. Then please open the gate. It is well past time for Magda to die. Let's go kill her, but I guess it's not going to be that easy. It's probably going to take its time. Magda will soon pay for your death, Deckard King. Still waiting. I need arcane power. Done. I was pressing the wrong button again. I always press 3, but I have to press 2 for my meteors to come down. It's kind of... Eh. It's kind of annoying, but if that's me. Is this like a snake pass or? Okay, let's take a look at this achievement. Though the champions are larger and the lunatics more devastating, it is the shaman priests who lead the fallen. These shrunken, unintimidating demons can easily kill an enemy with their fireballs. 
their ability to resurrect their in allies that allows them to command such high respect from their peers. Okay, let's take a What's going to say? Let's take a look at the achievement. I guess, I guess. And I'm running the wrong thing. But I'm in Okay, here we see. Achievements. Um kill one of the following unique enemies. Oh I killed a unique enemy. Nice. Okay. Pretty cool. Dungeon The Ruins Level 1 Seems like big ruins um, What the hell is that? of Kegistan are majestic, expansive, and full of stinging swarms of insects. They may seem a minor nuisance, but these vermin carry numerous strains of pestilence. One of them was trapped in my boot once, and my foot swelled up to the size of a melon before the infection cleared. What horrible creatures! Oh wow, what the hell is that? like a ball and it's turning really slow oh what the hell I I always don't know where to go because there are always multiple paths I don't know. I wouldn't say it's annoying, it's... It's weird, because... I don't know. What if I miss something? Right? can just squeeze this beast, he's on the ground. There are like small little insects. These guardian towers are really weak. I'm just saying. Might not be the right thing to defend everything you have with. This was some kind of magical device must have been destroyed along with its master. Well, maybe one day someone will rebuild it and use it for good or evil. Oh wow, did you see that? Pillow clap, I like that. Of course, the other one doesn't. Damn it. Uh, 
Man, a book of valorous manuscript lists as modern as the best battlefield commander of all demons. Having defeated the angels many times in the eternal conflict across pandemonium, and the prime evils in the demonic civil war. If the Lord of Sin ever assaults our realm, we truly have much to fear. Okay. Let's take a look. Did I miss anything? There's something down there. Okay. I might have missed something. The way out or the way to the next level. Or something like that. Or maybe nothing. Your it is nothing. The light of the Seraphim radiates from him. He was an angel, but he relinquished his power to side with us in our battle. You have been blessed by many. But I want to know. Some kind of magical device. You have Must already have been destroyed along with its master. Oh wow. Okay. Still waiting. There we go. The ruins level 2, that's not where I want to go just yet. here. I love this chicken move, it's really useful. Really Not so good. Oh, I missed it, damn it. Um, journal. The Valorous <laughs> manuscript lists as modern as the best battlefield commander of all demons. Having defeated the angels many times in the eternal conflict across pandemonium and the prime evils in the demonic civil war. If the Lord of Sin ever assaults our realm, 
We, we already have much I don't know. Fear. This is a really big place. Holy God. I mean, it's just a dungeon. I think we have done this entire level at this point. Um, yes, we have. Look at this. It's huge. Okay. Next level. This destruction is nice. After playing Flash Battle of Exiles, to see a little bit of a destruction is really nice. Okay, let's go to level 2. A ruins level 2. demons are large and imposing. The dust imps are little more than children in size, but they possess the cunning and bloodlust of far larger creatures. They take cover in the shadows, emerging only when viable prey wanders too close. Then they ambush, leaving little more than bones behind them. Achievements. Among the oh damn it, I don't want to do that. Among the elite, kill 200 champions, rare over unique item uh, items, enemies, imps lab, knock back five imps at once. Okay. I didn't know I could get that. That's cool, I guess. Almost another level up. It's really flying. 
These dungeons, holy shit. Turns. There we go. Um. I just went to Gandalf mode and killed him. She actually might have been the end boss, well, mini boss, I don't know, maybe not. Need more arcane power. Let's see. Oh my god. Don't scare him. My power grows. Go. Um, arcane at human. We will take a look at this in a bit. A lot of garbage in my inventory. The world looks so different in this age. Um, oh, so. skills. It is tired, Electrocute tired doesn't have anything new. Or gain torrent. Do you have anything new? Nope. Cross Nova. No. Meteor. Nope. Storm thingy. Nope. You. No. Um, cold blooded. Okay, nothing changed. What I am going to do, however, is is this the end of the dungeon? It is. Okay. Diablo was the youngest of the prime evils, but I found him the most dangerous, for his power over terror left him incapable of feeling fear. Though he had easily possessed and corrupted many humans, Diablo's essence was finally trapped in a soul stone and banished to the unfathomable abyss 20 years ago. Okay, let's go back to the entrance of the dungeon. And I will open a portal to scroll go back. back to town. Here we go. Should probably stop picking up all this junk all the time. It's probably not Mister, helping anyone, especially things. not me. We should take a look. Um. 
Here we go. Sell all of that junk. You have something to say? A return to bloody. How does it feel to be back in Chaldea? I told myself I'd never come back here. And yet here I am. Because of what happened to your father. Because of what happened to me. Some scars don't heal. There's no point in scratching at them, is there? The weather doesn't suit me either. Okay. Um, change this to the city. Have things changed much in Chaldeum since you've been gone? Last time I passed through here was soon after meeting Mira. She wanted to stop and see the city, but I convinced her to travel on. My good memories of Chaldeum feel like I'm watching someone else's life. I'll be glad for us to be gone. Okay, let's put some stuff in the chest. Plonk. Plonk. And... Plonk. And thank you everyone for watching. And I will see... Wait. First I will talk to those two. Um, talk. Blue ties. Do you have any other family, Lyndon? My brother and I were orphans. We only had each other. Is he a thief as well, then? No. He was a member of the city guard. That seems odd. Not as much as you might think. Until the end, that is. Um, Templar. What do you have to say? Becoming a Templar. How does one become a Templar, anyway? Were you born to the Order? No. Our scripture says, As a farmer reaps his wheat, so must the Order harvest and purify the weeds. That seems a little unfair. You are not a weed. You speak out of kindness, but you do not understand. When they took me, they saved my life and my immortal soul. Okay. Uh, you have something else to say? Brothers divided. Why didn't you become a guard like your brother? We're not much alike, really. He was always dependable and practical. A complete bore, I'd say. And you were drawn to trouble? Hardly. I was just amusing myself with the Thieves' Guild. It was nothing serious. Until you were a wanted man. <laughs> uh, that may have been serious. Okay, Templar, you have something else to say? Sins? You told me that your order saved your soul by recruiting you. What are these sins that haunt you? I cannot tell you. No good comes from ignoring the past. You should seek knowledge, not hide from it. You misunderstand me. We are literally unable to recall our past. The Inquisitors stripped my sins and the memory of them from me, leaving me pure. Okay, that's a little bit scary. Tell me more about your order. Why did they make you forget your past? Our initiation blinds us to our sinful pasts. So... Oh. Damn it. In Lessons. the Ashari Sanctum, certain books were considered forbidden. No one was permitted to lay eyes on them. That is wise. Knowledge can indeed corrupt. No, you're wrong. One of those books held the prophecy that brought me here. Your order binds you in rules and calls you a sinner. What if you were to recover your memories and find no sin in your past at all? I cannot lie. That has occurred to me. But if it were true, it would ruin everything I fight for. Everything. Okay, next time we will go back and continue our mission to find Alcarnus. Um, so, thank you all for watching and I will see you later. Bye bye.